yesterday, the team went full out to meet Colin and Justin's demands to finish a day early. Keep painting. And the homeowners learnt that size can matter in the bedroom. This is your bedroom. Hi! <laughs> oh, this is nice. Nice. Yeah. Do you have the clicker? Day five and dress day has come 24 hours early. But happily after Colin and Justin's last minute stair rods are installed, there's nothing left to do. At least, not for some. Luckily, the construction is done. But for art department, we're going to be here all night, probably into the wee hours of the morning, just dressing. Hey guys. Gorgeous. Don't you love it? I just kicked out all the construction crew. They're all gone. Just finished. Yeah. So they're out early as well. It just goes to show, if you push and shove, you can achieve incredible results. Nice. Oh, hey guys. Wow. It's not done yet. Almost there, but we're just trying to see where every piece is going to sit. Just love, love, love. This bold straight against the toile. That, that works incredibly well. No hint of gold exactly as well. Exactly as planned. And these are the homeowner's chairs, obviously painted yes. black and red upholstered. We upholstered it with the really same nice. pattern as the wallpaper. Okay. We've created massive change here. As promised, Colin and Justin are about to show Sid and Roberta how to add a last touch of timeless grandeur to their new hallway. But first, they want to see what floral delights they come up with on their own. Oh, thank you. Oh, this looks like a mess. Have we, to be honest? Yeah. That's terrible. <laughs> no, I can't really do much more than that. I can't do any more damage. Right. You're having a laugh. This looks like you actually chewed up the flowers and then vomited them into the glass. This is an affront <laughs> to our creativity. Mother nature is angry. <laughs> Your flowers will not appear in the final vision. Now watch this. <laughs> a little single forehead taken from the top. Pop from oh, top there, okay? You do the same again three times. Go on, You Jack. create visual connection with this grass. You don't actually need to spend a lot of dollars to really get the design right. For example, a huge big glass vase position centerpiece. All of a sudden, a nice statement. Something as simple. I mean, these are free. You go out into the forest and you collect all those gorgeous cones. Take a vase. Yes. Any vase. Go on, take a vase, baby. Don't put too much water in your vase, you know, because if you do that, your flowers won't last as long and they really start to rot and start to smell. Put half an aspirin in the water as well. Right. And it'll actually um, allow them to live for a lot longer. Right. Oh, look. I think it's really nice to have Pretty. flowers inside the, the vase rather than projecting from outside. Just pop it in there like that. How no. easy. So oh, incredibly easy and so incredibly pretty. That's that. beautiful. Meanwhile, like, look, no more flowers, okay? Okay, okay. And there's news, and the news is good. Now You're going to give you your house back early. Yes. All right. Oh, so you can oh, actually good. come oh, back good. first thing tomorrow. You don't have to wait. Come back tomorrow morning without your Lost in Space t-shirts because oh, you're good. not Lost in Space anymore. Wonderful. I told you they okay, do it. Okay, guys. They did it. Yeah. Go on, off you pop. <laughs> Bye. Yeah. See you later, guys. Yeah. Adorable, but boy, he's hard work. This is an absolutely brilliant scheme. Gorgeous twelve as you. Very, very monochromatic. What you've got to remember when you're doing a monochromatic room is to add an extra colour, a third shade, so that your eye literally has somewhere else to go. And gold, on this particular occasion, is a colour of choice. Meanwhile, have a little look at that. Look at the sparkle. If you remember, we went online and we picked these wonderful stair rods that we described as being a bit of a bit of jewellery for the staircase, you know. And I think that's exactly what they are. You know, we pick up a beautiful metal, scatter it all the way up the stairs there, and truly transform this into a stairway to heaven. If you're trying to go for a look that's all about glamour, then trust us because it's the little things that will add up to create this. Now look at this little problem. Roman blind positioned at the top line of the window. It should be okay, but in actual reality, it ain't okay because what we have here is a huge big reveal of wallpaper. If you want to make your window look that bit bigger, this is what you've got to do. Follow me. Same blind, no bigger expense. We've simply positioned it higher, therefore masking the problem that we started with. 
Can we just for one lovely second absorb the fabulous transformation in this hall? It's hard to believe how it started. Now for me, one of the most important parts when dressing a hallway is to add some type of self-furnishing, a stool or a chair or a banquette, anything that can take the hallway from being simply a hallway and make it a room of its own. And it's good to know the bedroom also receives the Cheryl seal of approval. The day of the reveal and the family get twitchy. I'm flexing. What can I say? Come on, why are I we know. doing that? Let's let us in there. And all that blue leaves Roberta in need of oxygen. <laughs> wow. Wow. Oh, my God. Wow. We've actually shut her up. 